Okay, I'm going to read from another, um, it's called a local talk paper, and I'm just going to read from the pastor's heart, and he is Pastor Dr. Robert Kennedy. We learn to love. In our family life presentations, my wife and I argue, like many social scientists, that we were not born loving. We were born with a deficiency capacity to love. However, if such capacity is carefully nurtured so that it will continuously be filled with love, then we will all be able to love. Dr. Leo, who was given the title Professor at Large at the University of Southern California, became one of the most popular professors because of a course he taught and the first book he published called Love. He was moved by a student's suicide to contemplate human disconnectedness and the meaning of life. And he began a non-credit class he called Love 1A. It surprised the university when this became one of the most popular course on campus. Dr. Love, as he was officially called, passed away in 1998, but his thesis that human beings having to learn to love still stands. Love is not taught, but caught. He argued for the seven following uh, postulates of love. Love, one cannot give what he does not possess. To give love, you must possess love. Number two, one cannot teach what he does not understand. To teach love, you must comprehend love. Number three, one cannot know what he does not study. To study love, you must live in love. Number four, one cannot appreciate what he does not recognize. To recognize love, you must be receptive to love. Number five, one cannot have doubt about that which he wishes to trust. To trust love, you must be convinced of love. And number six, one cannot admit what he does not yield to. To yield to love, you must be vulnerable to love. And last but not least, number seven, one cannot love what he does not dedicate himself to. To dedicate yourself to love, you must be forever growing in love.